Um, the title of my piece is Enchantment. Um, it is to be kind of an enchanting forest-like feel. Um, and then it's sort of an environment inside, and that's why the hands were changed and altered and turned to face this way instead to kind of make a, a place that you could go in and interact with and feel like you were a part of. I had in the back of my mind that I maybe wanted to include small things. I love details and color. Um, each color, there's nothing on there that's straight out of a bottle. Um, everything's been mixed and layered to create more of a rich appearance. And then I decided to start thinking of things that I find enchanting. Well, a lot of us would name things from, from princess movies and stuff like that. And so there are things like wizards, um, magic wands, uh, magic pumpkins um, involved in the sculpture, little, little pictures that you can find. But my favorite thing, the most important to me, is a little airplane. Um, that's, um, it was my dad's airplane that he had when I was a kid. He had been in World War II and uh, he had this little two-seater airplane. I was in it once and I painted that as one of the objects that's enchanting. Probably the hardest thing to find is a little angel that's looking down on you. So that's a little clue there to find it. It's probably one of the hardest. You can find them. You might have to crawl around and climb and look under. And then I guess I should mention the bench. A safe place to just kind of sit there and interact or be comfortable if you can't crawl around or whatever is easily. So a comfy place to sit. <laughs> a great incentive for me as an artist to get to work on, on a certain project with kind of a goal in mind and, and to support something um, bigger than, than just myself, I guess. <laughs>